people don't fake birdie much in low ranks. Birdie is... Apparently people don't fake birdie in higher ranks either because Dr. Meg, or DRD Meg, is uh... Round one. Rockin' the Blanca. Fight. The Blanca chant outfit. Sorku going with a normal, is a, it is a normal amount of first ton outfit. Dr. Mag has got the punishes on those whip anti-airs. What are you doing pressing those anti-airs without making sure that Blanc is getting all the way over to you? What are you doing? Oh, side switch. Dr. Mag able to get that, uh, that Block with a great anti-air on the air legs. Remembering to block after the tech throws, not to get caught by the medium punch EX legs, and Mag takes a convincing round one. Round two. No, oh, no, our losers finalist um, uh, forfeited the tournament because uh, he had some IRL stuff to do. Oh no, a bad medium punch gets jumped in on, although no real combo out of Mag, but he's still working on that perfect Thorku. Finally getting a hit in, getting an anti-air, and finally not being overly eager with his anti-airs. Working, trying to push forward, throwing out those, those fierce, no whiff punish on the sweep, a little bit too late on that. Oh no, trying to use EX legs on the landing frames of... Rainbow Ball, no good, but catches the Rainbow Ball on the other side, has corner control, has a slight light lead, but gets crush countered. Mag going straight for that side switch. B trigger shenanigans. Thorku with all the blocks right now, gets the back throw. Gets the shimmy. Is this going to be enough to kill? Not quite enough to kill. Doesn't believe in the EX uh, up ball. Gets the frame trap. The to clinch out that round, Thorku takes one back. Good and here, same side, gets the combo. Oh, does a delayed back tack. Great of the EX up bug. Great punish on the light Blanca block. Continuing that EX uh, leg pressure. Continuing the punishes on the light balls, but Dr. Mag getting the slide in the V-Trigger activation, clearing up that stun, has a fighting chance. Great blocks by Soroku, great check, not falling for any of it right now. Great challenge and hit confirm. Mag challenging that forward heavy kick. In a little bit of trouble, although he's got the resources to close it out. Tries to bait out an up ball, but... Darku just continuing to get a couple straight hits in there. Only one more needed in order to close it out. And then the trade on the overhead does it. Darku takes game one. I'm trying to show up all the Chun costumes right now. Round one. Mag letting the blocker Blanca rock. Maybe it's a counter pick that he has. As he eats two fists to the face. Bad slide gets punished. Oh, but then the fierce crush counters and then gets a jump in Sorku not fast enough with the anti air. Oh man, that's brutal. Alright, punishes the sweep. And then finally the EX up ball comes. Sorku not prepared for it. Gets hit. Dark Mag not falling for the air reset. Able to recognize it in time before going on to Dustin's combo. Gets the crush counter. Not able to combo on the side. Activates V Trigger though. Using the block ball. Get over with the other side. Surely that was a setup on a quick rise, but Sorku doing the back rise. Alright, here we go. V Trigger shenanigans. What's it gonna be? Oh, gets caught with a cross. That was a cross up. That was a cross up. That was a cross up. We got a question in chat though. Um, both players can get KO'd at the same time and games are able to be tied. You're actually able to tie games by doing a double KO. If it happens in rank, you actually both lose points. Anyways, Sorku 
spending that meter right now, going for the instant air overhead, missing it though. Working on that corner pressure. Dark Mag gets the side switch into V Trigger shenanigans. Perku with some challenges. Just some, just some. V Trigger runs out. Survive the storm. Oh, look, getting tagged. Oh no, Sword is getting. Getting the beat trigger activation damage, frame trap, not falling for it. Dr. Mag just on a pixel of falling for that tr frame trap. Forgot, I'm going to assume forgot about the beat trigger. You got, you have to respect it, especially if you don't have the life. Oh man, Sorku anti air and the side switch to Dr. Mag not respecting it, not able to react in time. Going for the instant air stop, Dr. Mag with the, with the, uh, the blocks. Does well for himself, gets himself out of the corner, although Stork who's got the life lead, gets the crush counter, goes for a reset, Dark Meg pressing buttons, gets a hit confirmed too, and a throw, evening up, starting to even up the life lead, but a good slide, and v activation in the super is going to close out this game. Stork is going up, 2-0. Win. Who's it? Round one. All right. All right. You already made right. stick with the blanket pick. <coughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> I swallowed some spit. Starts things off pretty strong. Has like no punish on the sweep. But Dorothy and some frame traps in there. Dr. Mag with the challenge, getting in there with the jump. About to take this round. Great block on the overhead. Dorothy is starting, starting the comeback route. Going for the frame, B trigger frame traps. Good anti air. Doesn't believe in the up ball. Goes for the medium throw. Gets it. But then gets slid on. Not enough to kill. Great block on the EX spinning bird kick. And Mag makes the round. Bad slide to start things off. And an anti air, but a good punish on the neutral though. Dr. Mag still does find himself almost in the corner. Trying to find his way out as he gets crushed counter. And the good combos, but oh! A, wow, that the rainbow ball didn't fully connect, gets punished for it. That's so unfortunate. Gets a V trigger activation though, that's trying to stay out, save off that stun. Uses a little bit of V trigger, but then gets catch the sword trying to press a button or something, gets hit. Only a minimal, minimal amount of damage though. As Sorok is trying to close out this round. Dark Mag using the rest of his V trigger to make the block ball safe, but gets hit by the overhead. Sorok goes on to reset point. Right. Both, play both players being much more patient this, this round. Very little snagging's going on, although Sorku gets the crush counter. Far, too far away to get a, a full punish, but able to uh, continue some damage. Tries to be out of the block and roll, but Mag being very patient, not letting him rip too frequently. Sorku trying to bait it out again, Dr. Mag having the read, waking up buttons. Gets the tick throw, evening out the life lead. It's pretty even. Mag does have the V trigger tag and Soroku activating his own. Both of them are just going to be waiting to get an act uh, press. No, no activation at the crouch medium kick counter hit, but does get it at the end. Confirmed in the super and Soroku resets the bracket in a clean, a clean 3-0. That is such a weird song. A clean 3-0 over Mags Blanca. Do that real quick.
Yeah, we'll reset it. Now we gotta switch sides in the brackets. Be in there. Alright, let's see if uh, Mag... If Mag Negro decides to stick with... Um, the Blanca, or if he was just trying to get a little bit oh, of... Uh, tournament experience with it. With him. Um, before switching back to the birdie. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see soon enough. Hold on to your horses. Yo, Cammy. <laughs> that was right. All of a sudden, this becomes a Cammy Monot uh, Grand Finals. Oh, Mag Switching to the Dulcim. All right, that's not something I've seen out of him yet. Although Tim was saying that um, the Meg does like to break the Dulcim out against his birdie. But we'll see. Round we'll one. see how practice is as we get into the super thirsty turn outfit. Oh, the back heavy punch, hitting that limb, not crush counter again though. Mag, getting a little bit damn there. Oh, catching the B skill. Oh, with the. Real well space drill, not able to combo it though. It must have been a drop combo because that was definitely the light flame. But the B skill catching that that jump float B skill. And then the air legs catching Mag Tech and throw, and then a back throw. That stun and should be to death as long as Soroku doesn't drop his combo. Which he doesn't, taking a round two. very, a very clean one. round one. Oh, that back here looks so good in this matchup. That's nuts. Wow, challenging that plus range after the meaty slide too. Mag expecting a, uh, a spinning bird kick. Never came, but then the stomp catching out the anti-air. Stomp catching out the jump too. Mag is just getting hit all over the place. Soroku disrespecting the negative frames. Getting countered for it yet again. Really surprised that he has the extended break didn't really come, but oh! The snipe gets punished by the EX legs, V trigger activation. Frame traps. Oh, good blocks, good blocks. He's gotta wait, watch out for the snipe. Oh, catches the air, and then catches! Catches the teleport, closing out the game. Very close, but Chun Li wins. Are you too strong for uh, Mag's Dalsum? At least in this this first game. Let's see if he sticks with it. Round he does. One. He's not. He's not backing down. Starting things off the teleport, Soroku being a little bit calmer. Waits a while before throwing out the back fears. Just opting to eat the uh, the fireball, but gets hit by a drill. Mag looking much better this time. This time around. Catching Soroku with some flame drops. Catching the V skill with a fireball. Oh, and you're not fast enough. Gets counter hit with a stomp, but Soroku not getting much out of it. But, oh, another limb gets crushed countered by that back fear. So, it's so good. It's so good. Getting that low confirmed. B trigger activation. Good job recognizing no get up. To avoid the guard crush scenario, but gets back thrown in the stun. That's gonna do it. Sword takes the round two. Point. Dr. Mag once again getting off to a reasonably strong start. Oh, ooh, getting them with that air gale. Looking so good right now. Maybe slide in here. Mag looking so good, but gets caught by the V skill. By the, um, not the V skill, but like that, that kick side switch thing, whatever it is. It's like a forward medium kick or something. I don't know. Point is, Dr. Mag is almost on stun and then gets. Done. Oh, is this gonna be enough to kill? It might be enough to kill. He's going for it. It's not enough to kill. It isn't. But it's close. 
going for the guard crush setup. Thark knew. He knew that wake up super wouldn't have done it. Wake up super wouldn't have done it. I guess super takes too long to hit him. Way too long. Astro. Mr. Kami himself. It's go time. I am the Kamikaze Warrior. That's right. Alright. Man having enough. Enough of this Dalsim crap, this Blanca crap. He's switching up his characters Let's again. He might be switch. He might be switching back to the birdie. No more screwing around. Not screwing around, right? No, no more screwing around. No, go with the Sagan. Breaking out all the characters tonight. All of them, alright. He must really, he must really dislike the, uh... Great uppercut. Great Annie here, by the way. He must really dislike the Chun Birdie matchup, and he's really trying to find a, uh, a counter pick for it. Alright, starting the zoning. Oh, sliding over that, under that fireball. Alright, Mag doing a pretty good job zoning. Oh, tries to get a V skill, but no, you can't get a V skill there. It takes too long. And with that, Sorker gets in there, gets the life leap and corner control. Dr. Mag in trouble. Oh, man, getting hit by the EX legs. Sun dies down, but he's going to die before stun happens. Anyways, going with that V trigger 2, getting a little bit of V trigger 2 action going in there. Great anti here. Uh, Sorker 2 activates V trigger and then blocks the EX DP. I'm pretty sure that's minus. I'm not sure that that was a very good EX DP. Just saying. I'm pretty sure V trigger is minus on block. I'm kind of going to check right now, but I disagree with any XCP. Sorry, with a good combo confirmed with that corner pressure again. Mag in trouble. Yes, the crush counter doesn't follow it up with the DP. Bad tiger knee spacing. Oh no. He gets a decent punish, but a great V trigger. Uh, armoring through that heavy kick. Another great V trigger. Following um, that, and then just supering the fireball. Oh man, that should be enough to kill him. No, not quite enough. Almost there. Gets him with the frame trap. Uh, Magtronic. Uh, trying to uh, tech a throat or something. Doesn't matter. Balls. Balls. To the Chun Li of Soroku. And with that, we're gonna try and sneak the game in. Saying, you know, I'm, I've been I've been waiting here for so long. You know, you know, maybe, maybe. Ah, oh, he doesn't. Ah, oh, he doesn't want to play. Ah, oh, brutal. Ah, oh, right in the heart. Just twist, just twisting that knife. Just twisting that knife. Ugh. All right, well, GG's everyone. GG's. Been a very fun stream. Taking. You know, substituting for Joe Money, really like, really, um, yeah, I am hosting this. Substituting for Joe Money, because he's on vacation this week, so I, you know, I took it up. Ran the tournament tonight, we had a really great show, and we had 49 players. 49 players tonight, that's so many. One day the West Coast will get that big, right? Also, really strong showing on the, uh, the stream support. That's right, Joe is the Jeep, uh, Geef, Geef's gym guy. That's right. The community does not deserve Joe Monday. He, we do not deserve him. He's he's far too giving, far too nice, far too good of a person. 